All right, guys, welcome back. Hope you're having a great day. I actually had a very long day today, and considering what time it is now, I'm going to assume you guys are not going to get this video on Friday, so happy Saturday to everybody. Anyways, it was an interesting day. I had a visit from some of the top people from Anakin. They hung out for a few hours, and they brought me one of their brand new products that actually segues well from what we were talking about yesterday with those imposter jewel pods. So we got something from Inikin today. They are the experts at getting people off of them icky sticks and onto a safer alternative. And it's gonna be no exception with their brand newest and what I think could be the jewel killer and also the tiniest pod mod I've ever seen. So hang tight guys, it is the Inikin IO Jewel Killer today on Indoor Smokers. So that's right guys, check this thing out man. <laughs> freaking tiniest pod system I've ever seen, but somehow they still managed to pack just as much power and juice capacity as a Juul. Well, at least juice capacity. I think it's a 310 mAh built-in battery, and then you have a 0.8 juice capacity on these pods, even though to me they appear much smaller than a Juul pod, so I don't know how they squeeze all that juice or all that battery power in something that's small enough, I won't even say to fit in the palm of your hand. Because it's evident you could actually fit this thing in the roof of your mouth. But all right, before we go any further, guys, let's go ahead and fill this guy up. So I'm going to be using some of my Nick salts because this is a perfectly designed system for Nick salts. Although they also say it can be used for like CBD e juice as well. And of course, you can always use regular e juice. Now they do have this little tiny hole at the bottom here and I think with this needle nose bottle I've got I'll be able to fill it straight but before we do that I'll show you guys what else comes with it they got a kind of unique little funnel system you can use and then you also have micro USB and you do have a little tiny micro USB port right there on the bottom of the unit instruction book your Anakin pad another thing that's nice on here they do have your verification scratch and sniff to verify you know by smell that it's real actually there's a number i believe underneath of there well let's scratch it and see i hope this doesn't void the warranty yep so that gives you a number that you can check online and if you are blind then you got the scratch and sniff option too all right here we go guys check out the little funnel let's go ahead and use this to fill it up real quick like i said i think my bottle with this little tiny tip would have been small enough, but you know, a lot of them do have a little bit larger tips. So let's go ahead and do this. And then you can just leave that on and put the little lid on just like so. All right, ready to go. Put your little flip flap back down again. And then it does come with the replacement pod as well as all those other things I showed you guys earlier. No buttons, nothing to distract from just that perfect surface on here. They do have several different colors too, but I loved this rainbow looking one. I don't even know if the lighting's good enough for you guys to really see how shiny this thing is. Why don't we go ahead while this is soaking up a little bit, let it wick, take a look at your other color options available for this I.O. by Anakin. Oh, -E -O. A -O. I don't even know what the fuck that's from, but it came to my mind with that I.O. So, all right, guys. You do have a little LED light on there that's going to let you know the state of your battery. And you can see that it's working, that you got it firing. Now, in the pod itself, there's a 1.4 ohm resistance coil in there. So, let's go ahead and see how much vapor production you can get out of something that freaking tiny. Here we go. All right, not too bad. Something else I like about this. You can actually hold it in your mouth. It's so light, and the mouthpiece is sort of tapered down a little bit, so it gives you a little something to grip onto. Hell yeah! Way cooler than a jeweler! Come on, man. I can't even take credit for that. Somebody in the comments said it yesterday. Fucking amazing, tiny pod system. Look at that. Not quite. It's a little bit bigger than that, but I think we found a winner. 
Winner, winner, having weed for dinner. All right, guys, I'm going to do a couple more puffs on this. Let's see how much this thing can handle doing some actual serious vaping on it. Smooth. I like it, man. This is the stuff from Dollar E Juice. And today I'm vaping on their Blue Raspberry Belt. Fucking delicious. Some of the best tasting Nick salts, amazingly, because it is very inexpensive. $5.99 for a 15 mil bottle like that. So again, guys, portable, convenient, and most important, it lets you know what's in your pod, man. Actually reminds me of a story that I had heard yesterday. I think it had actually happened last spring about those middle school kids. I guess they were having some kind of a cooking contest or something in their eighth grade class. A bunch of boys got together, made crepes filled with a special sauce that happened to be composed of urine and semen, and then the teacher ate it. And I guess a video like went around circulated of them making it, so I don't know if this was like a team effort. They did it, or if each kid filled his own crepe. I don't know what the rules were, but that's some nasty shit. But now, I just heard recently that they're actually available deep fried at the Ohio State Fair now. I hear the people say they're freaking orgasmic. <laughs> they're so good. Woo! Everything's better deep fried. They know that in Ohio. So don't be like that, eighth grade teacher. Know what's in your pods. So I hope you guys are having a great vaping weekend. Um, use those links if you want to check out the products. The brand new little jewel killer. The I.O. from Inakin. Especially if you guys are thinking of getting off them icky sticks. I will put a link to the Inakin I.O. As well as to where you can get some Nick salts. Just like the stuff they put in the jewel. But no imitators. And then if you have not yet already, please do subscribe to this channel. Your subscription means everything to me. You can go ahead and ring that little bell, ring a ding ding. That's going to make sure you get notified when my videos go up. Otherwise, just make sure you're checking your subscription tab on your phone so you can see when I'm uploading. And then other than that, I'm just going to need you guys to make like this in a kin I.O. and disappear. Disappear.